announcements to make before we get started. Um, I want to recap on the premium patrons for November. Uh, Joe Mack, you're, you were the come in at the last minute here. Got All right. Sorry, I had a call, so it interrupted the, the video. But anyway, to continue on with the premium patrons, we got Michael Bibbler, Mark Goodwin, <clears throat> Jarrett Otworth, Mike McDave, and Billy McMillan. Thank you guys. I appreciate every one of my patrons. I really do. Um, and also, my super premium patrons, which they're, they put in $20 a month, so they get two chances. Um, we got, of course, Alaska American, Jeff uh, Corter, Kyle Hines, and Doc Rose. You guys are in there twice, so you got two chances each to win. Um, what we're going to have for the, for the November draw, what we're getting ready to do. Oh, yeah, here's the names here. We'll get them put in here real quick. There's Billy McMillan. Mike McDade, uh, Jeff Otworth, Mark Goodwin, I dropped one, Joe Mack, and Michael Bibbler. And we're inside the truck because it's real windy. And if I try to talk with that camera going, you wouldn't be able to hear me. So that's done. Where is the, where do I put the lid to that? I have no idea. <clears throat> I don't know. Oh, I got it right here. Uh, okay. I took it off. That's my fault. So anyway, as you can see, I have you scroll back here in the back. We've got the metal detector and uh, the boxes, small flat rate boxes of the of the uh, the high banker cons that we got. <clears throat> and each one of those boxes has got some pretty good gold in them. And then we're also going to have a box. I'm going to uh, draw a box of, of unsearched pit cons. So, uh, and, and another thing I want to let you guys know, uh, this coming week, I'm gonna get. Uh, I'm getting two care packages. I'm gonna be sending two care packages off. Uh, I'm gonna pick out a female and a male uh, to send it to uh, someone in the military that's overseas. Um, so it's gonna be their Christmas care package. I'm also gonna put a. Uh, I've got some extra uh, GPAA magazines. I'm gonna throw a couple of those magazines in for them. <laughs> and all right, so let's get the draw done first. Let's do. We're gonna start out with. We're doing a bucket sluice from from Spike Strike Prospecting, then the metal detector, then a pocket mat dream mat, six of the high banker cons, and then a box of the unsearched cons. So I'm going to take the phone, and I, well, before I do, I'm going to make sure so I'll get the shake up really, really good. And then I'm going to turn the phone over, and I'm going to have Dustin. There you go. Take that, Trim and it. I will grab the phone all right we are gonna draw there you go and when you draw in there yeah no looking just draw down in there and grab one name and name first name is Jacob Monahan Jacob Monahan congratulations you won the bucket sluice from spike strike so we're gonna put that over here that's the first one all right Shake her up. This one's for the metal detector. And the metal detector is, is Joe Mack. Joe Mack. Congratulations. That's the first time he was the last one in. All right. Okay. Hey, reach in there and stir it around when you get down in there, too. Reach in there, stir it around, stir it around, and then grab one. <laughs> Walter Reese. Walter Reese. Walter Reese, you get the pocket dream dream mat mini sluice. All right. Next, and then the next six is going to be for the pit high banker cons, the ones in my videos that I ran and showed you the gold on the cleanouts. That would be Bill Ferris. Bill Ferris. Bill Ferris, congratulations. We got five more of those to go. Sorry. Uh, you got to pull one. I know, pull... they were stuck together. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's funny. Uh, Jeff? Jeff Quarter. Jeff, congratulations. Four more of those. Billy McMillan. Yeah, Billy McMillan. All right. Three more of those. Rose. 
Doc Rose. Doc Rose, you win one. Congratulations. We got we got one, two, two more for the pit time. Jarrett Otworth. Yeah, he's a newbie too. So let's see, we got one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one more. All right. Corey Hageman. Corey, congratulations. And now it's for a box of the unsearched pit cons. <laughs> Prospectors Radio. Congratulations, Prospectors Radio. That's Tim Grimes. All right, so put the lid on there. On that one, I'm going to save these because I know as soon as I open the door, it's going to blow away. Yes, it will. Okay, here, take this. And I'm going to get these put in order as they start going. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so we got that. Now I'm going to stick these right here so they don't blow away. And let's see. All right, let's go with that. See, I'm getting you know, two care packages. Um, also, for the December Christmas giveaway, this is the big one, guys. Um, what I'm giving away is a gold ram from Spike Strike Prospecting, uh, one of the string sluices from Robinson Prospecting, a Garrett Gravity Trap Gold Panty Kit, a pocket. Uh, green mat mini sluice, a bag of my Alaska uh, uh, pay dirt is from the gold that I got when I went to Alaska this year, uh, a bag from the Ohio State DTAA chapter of pay dirt, another box of unsearched pit dirt, and also we're also doing our I'm doing my Christmas uh, tree contest for this month. It ends December 31st. Um, what I'm doing is I'm going to have my daughter. You submit, if you're a premium patron, you submit a photo of your Christmas tree. I'm going to have my daughter pick out the three that she likes the best. And each one of you are going to get a picker for my personal stash. So um, I know some people don't believe in Christmas and that's their religion or whatever. But the ones that are due, that are premium patrons, um, put a picture of the Christmas tree. And like I said, I'll have the daughter um, pick it out. And man, we're getting so close to the goal of 50. Um, once we reach our goal of 50 premium patrons, you guys won't realize how uh, how much stuff we're giving away for that. And I think we're 10 away, 10 away from uh, reaching our goal of 50. Um, and just to let everybody know, the post office is getting really slow. I sent a bunch of the large flat rate boxes out of, um, excuse me, unsearched pit cons, and usually it takes two to three days. And it shows when expected delivery is. Some of them has taken over a week. So um, the post office is running a little bit behind. So the ones that did win uh, for my November draw, even though if you've won before, please send me your address. I, that's one thing I don't care. I probably should start writing them. As a matter of fact, I'll start writing them down. Um, just send me your address. Uh, you can send it to me in Facebook Messenger or email it to me if you're not uh, if you don't have a Facebook account at Indiana Gold Hunter at gmail.com. And I think that's it. So anyway, we're here at the pit, and boy, oh boy, do we have a surprise for you. We're going to take it outside. It'll be a little windy, but I'm going to show you what we got going here. Let me see that. Thank you, Dustin, you for your help. Sir? Yeah, it's getting real windy. It's beautiful outside, though. Look at there. Would you look at that? Just look at it. We've got the dredge, baby. We got some major, major rain uh, yesterday, and it was enough to fill it up. So guess what? Instead of running high bankers, we're doing this the easy way. We got the three-inch dredge fired up, ready to rock. So we're gonna get it over in the hole, and once we start dredging, we'll bring it back on and uh, show you a little fun we're gonna have. We're gonna get lots of gold today, and I'm gonna have lots of more gold to give away for my Christmas giveaway. Anyway, we'll be back. Yeah, baby, we're dredging the pit. 
I love it. It's a little bit cold, but he got my wetsuit on. It's in the 60s. Would you look at that? Just look at it. We're moving massive amounts of material to fit today. We are going to have some nice gold. I'm glad we got all that rain from yesterday. First time Dustin's on a dredge. Look at that. It's awesome. Man. Well, I don't know if we're going to... Yeah, sure, I'll bring it back out on the clean out. You'll probably want to see what he's got. I'm running the dream mat on my dredge, my dredge dream mat. So anyway, we'll be back. how the cells are just loaded with black sands. I mean, it's unreal. I mean, look at that black sand. Look at that. Just look at it. cleaned up for him so we'll be back all right well dude is down in there ready now Five eleven and one hundred and forty-five pounds, one hundred and fifty. 
Well, we're doing a quick clean out. This tan is loaded. When I got it to the bottom of this black tub, there was gold all over the bottom of it. It was unreal. I just wanted to do a quick pan. Look at that. Look at all that. Would you look at that? Just look at it. It's amazing. Oh, I can see gold in it. Oh, here. yeah, I can too. Oh, my gosh. Unbelievable. I get home tonight, I'll run mine across it easy clean, and I'll send you a picture and you can put it on Facebook or whatever. Alright. Golly, that black sand is just un unreal. It gets a ton of it. Yeah, look at that. And I guarantee you, you're washing a ton of gold out, dude. I know I am. <laughs> Good thing, huh? Extra long underwear, shirts, extra two extra pa or a pair of pants I wore, extra pair of pants. I didn't bring no damn long underwear or underwear. I'm washing gold out. I'm just gonna have to pan, pan down and show you what I got from here. Gold is everywhere. just. Hang on, let me get rid of this. Look at that. I, I'm sitting there. I mean, look at all some the... pepper stuff in there. Yeah. That that right there is what I'm getting. I mean, I, I it's it's everywhere in here. So much of this down, it's unreal. We just keep going and see what kind of big stuff is in there. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this. Hopefully, you'll have a couple big pieces like I have. And see what I got? I just did like one, I just took my pan in there and scraped some up, and it was loaded. Oh my god. Dude, you're not gonna believe this. Oh, I believe it. No, you just don't understand. No, I believe it. I've seen them. Uh, I gotta take my man. I'll leave my gloves on. Oh, I just washed my bunch. Of stuff. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay, now I see them. Move your hands right there. Watch that right there. Oh, boy, they're rocking. It. It's just all over that pan. It's all over the. It's everywhere. Now you're starting to float. It's everywhere. All right. There we go. Now I can get some of these damn things out of there. Look at that piece. Oh yeah, it's about like about the size of the piece I found on mine. Whole pan full of those. <laughs> That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Ooh. Look at that piece. Ooh. That sounds big, didn't it? Ooh. Yeah, well, you should have heard the. I wish everyone could have. I could have caught it on camera. You doing your gold song and dance when you was panning your pan down while I was dredging. That was priceless. That was priceless, buddy.
people in this, correct? Yeah. You are. If I offended anyone. I don't care if I offend anyone. The viewers might. Nah. You still have to get over it. How many drinks did you stop this for? Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's that guy's name? Carl something. Yeah, I know I did. That's okay. That's all right. Look, well, look. See right there? Yeah, that's what I was that's saying. just on that, on the back side there. Look at that. Just look at it. All right. rolling down. Oh yeah. There's another one in the state park. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm sure you do. Yeah. It's a little entrance. Man, those are some nice. Nice big meaty pieces. No more timing to put in. It's everywhere. Yeah. I mean I can't I could literally I can't keep this. That's all right. I'm washing all my big pieces down too. That's all right. I mean, there we go. We'll just show you right there. It's just loaded everywhere. I mean, it's it's all over. Top, bottom. Look at. I mean, even the pieces right here. Yeah. Right. You guys are a happy uh, patron. Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna get this stuff and I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it in a bucket or in a pan probably one of these totes like this just look at that and just let it dry out and just fill up start filling up small flat rate boxes and get what you get Dustin Beard behind the camera. This is Dennis Stacy in the end of the